Welcome to the channel guys. My name is Howard and I'm an Olympic badminton player. Today I'm actually going to show you guys how to grip your racket with some synthetic grip. So right here I have some of Yonix's AC102 standard white super grab. So we're going to have this little sticker which we can kind of set aside for now because we won't be using it until later. But the first thing that you'll notice as you unravel the grip is that there is this plastic backing on the top of the grip and we're gonna to need to peel this off later. The grip actually has two ends and on one end, it's actually flat. And on the other end right here, it's tapered and it has an adhesive at the, at the end. And so you can actually start on either side, whichever side that you do start from, we're always gonna start from the end of the racket. So now I'm gonna actually start gripping. We're actually gonna start with the edge that's tapered and has the adhesive because that's actually recommended by Yonix's standard procedure. So you're gonna take off the little sticker, it's a little adhesive, and we're gonna put it on the flat end of the grip right here, line it up with the bottom of the racket. Once it's down, I like to use my off hand to hold the grip right here and my right hand to kind of pull and to give it a little bit of tension right here. And I kind of just spin the handle as I go. And I use my thumb to kind of hold it down and to guide my grip. And so you're gonna wrap around the bottom like that, go around, and then you're gonna kind of start working your way up in a diagonal. And you'll notice that you're gonna start getting this guideline that you're gonna follow right here. This is your guideline. And you're gonna keep going along that line right here, just like that. And so one of the things that you do want to keep in mind is that you want to be consistent with the width right here. You don't want it to be too close and then too wide on the other. You want to maintain that consistency. And so like, as you'll notice here, I'm just going to keep following this line right here. See the little shadow right there? That's what I'm gripping right over every time. And so it's a consistent length, just like that spinning the handle and using your hand to give it some tension like that just keep going all the way through and so the harder that you pull obviously the thinner the grips gonna get because you're stretching it um, if you don't pull too hard it'll basically have this nice soft spongy feeling uh, if you pull harder obviously it'll also make the grip longer so you got to keep that in mind going all the way until you get to basically the height that you want some people like to go a little higher if they're a doubles player singles players don't usually grip as high and so when i get to the end here we're gonna have to cut this flat piece because if you don't and you tape right over it you're going to have basically edges showing on the side so this is going to be the top of where i grip to and so we're going to hold it out like this and you're gonna to wanna to basically cut in a diagonal from the top of the grip all the way down. And then you're gonna continue wrapping again. So you see how you still have that guideline and you see how it's flat on top. Now we can put the sticker on without having any edges showing on the top or on the sides. See like that. We'll put the sticker on so it holds the grip down. Just all the way around. So I hope that was helpful guys. I'm gonna be coming out with more videos on how to manage your equipment and more fire badminton content. So I'm gonna need you guys to subscribe to the channel, drop a thumbs up and comment below on what you guys wanna see next. Peace.